Sikhism emerged more than 500 years ago in Punjab, India and was founded by Guru Nanak Dev Ji. The Shri Guru Tegh Bahadur Holographic Auditorium and International Center for Sikh Studies is an ambitious project of the Delhi Sikh Gurudwara Management Committee implemented through Sun Foundation. The idea is to propagate the life, philosophy and teachings of Sikh Guru Sahiban and also showcase the unique martyrdom of the 9th Guru Shri Guru Tegh Bahadur Ji and the sacrifices made by the 10th Nayak Shri Guru Gobind Singh Ji at the center. ऐसी संस्था है इंटरनेशनल सेंटर फॉर सिख स्टडीज कि जिसमें हम चाह रहे हैं कि पूरी दुनिया में सिखिज्म का इमेज बनाया जाए क्योंकि दिस इज द न्यूएस्ट रिलीजन इन द वर्ल्ड द आइडिया ऑफ द शो वाज दैट द टेंपल मैजिक वांटेड टू क्रिएट अ शो व्हिच हैड अ डोम प्रोजेक्शन विद होलोग्राफिक प्रोजेक्शन द शो इज अबाउट सिखिज्म एंड अबाउट गुरु तेग बहादुर जी एंड हिज टीचिंग and you know educate people the next generation coming up about sikhism so this is the purpose of the show ab to mana ye bhi ka hai agar humne duniya ko unki bhasha mein batana hai unke idiom mein batana hai to we will have to go for new technology iske bagair hum logon ke paas jayenge we will not be able to communicate our but but we want to communicate Shri Guru Tegh Bahadur Holographic Auditorium and International Center for Sikh Studies is able to accommodate 300 people per sitting to enjoy the 45 minutes show that is knitted in a way that one can know the entire history of Sikhism from its inception to till date. The structure was already ready when we came. We couldn't change many things. The dome was already there. There was this empty space in the center. We had to take solutions from whatever we had. We couldn't change things. We couldn't add things. That was, I think, biggest challenge we faced in this project. So we suggested them to create this uh, cylindrical holographic structure in the center to create that uh, 3D effect in the center of the thing. It's a 55-minute show. Just watching on the dome for 10 minutes gets a little boring. So you need different mediums basically to express the story. It makes the show more interesting. The distance between the projection screen and the projector was not very much, so we had to cover. that area in a limited space so we use short through lenses so the reason we concealed the projectors because a lot of people you know they look around and see where the image is coming out from where the light is coming out from so that's the whole magic you know you need to hide the source if the audience comes and sees the projectors the magic is gone basically so this was the first project we used uh, optima projectors so optima projectors are very reliable the build quality is excellent but they very rugged the image quality is excellent i was pretty surprised when we saw the project the first time this is a first time we are uh, working in this large immersive project in india mss world are uh, renowned for working in this large uh, projects in the past they have been provided solutions in the edge blending warping and uh, similar kind of a solutions we were quite confident when the community have reached out to us uh, for uh, Uh, this kind of a solutions so we know that our product will fulfill the requirement what they are looking at because of our product quality uh, robustness of the products and the lenses what they are looking forward uh, to this kind of project we were quite confident about it uh, we are quite glad to work with icss and provided uh, solutions as per their requirement a team effort as me optima ka bahut bada role as equipment ka jo equipment pe hum isko play kar rahe hain main daily dekhta hu फिर भी मन करता है कि मैं और देखूं। हमारे गुरु साहबान की कमाल है जिनकी लाइफ ऐसी है जिनकी फिलोसफी ऐसी है जो प्रोडक्शन हुई है जो मशीनरी लगी है एवरीथिंग इज मार्वलस